Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss in brief about the P-doped conducting polymers. P-doped conducting polymers are obtained by the oxidation of conducting polymers. Best example for conducting polymer is polyacetylene with a Lewis acid. So, coming to the reaction, polyacetylene when treated with Lewis acid, it undergoes oxidation and it results in the formation of P-doped conducting polymer. So, coming to the mechanism of doping, especially whenever if we consider polyacetylene, it consists of alternate to double bonds. So, here in the first step, it undergoes oxidation. Oxidation means removal of electron. So, especially this double bond undergoes cleavage and with the result, the electron will be removed from this position and hence it results in the formation of ion radical and simply it can be called as polar and there will be no change with respect to the other double bonds and in the second step also ox it undergoes oxidation with the result one more electron will be removed so second electron will be removed from this ion and then it results in the formation of bipolar so once if we carefully observe the structure of bipolar it consists of two charges which are very close to each other and hence it gives instability to the polymer. So, with the result in order to get stable structure it undergoes segregation. Segregation means dispersal of the charge. Just charge dispersal takes place. With the result simply there will be change in the position of double bonds. Let us see after segregation what is the structure of the soliton pair. So, here this double bond will form a bond here and this double bond will form a double bond here. So, with the result just there will be change in the position of the double bonds and with the result this end carbon and opposite carbon will get the positive charges and here the two charges are far away from each other and it gives stability to the polymer and this is called as soliton pair. So, coming to the important applications of conducting polymers, these conducting polymers are highly useful in rechargeable batteries, analytical sensors, even they are used in ion exchanges, they are advised for the corrosion protection and also they are highly useful while designing the aircraft structures. If you like the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.